morning, Chiefs. I'm Ian. And I'm Kylie. And you are now watching the WKHS Morning Announcements. Now on to special announcements. Homecoming court applications are now outside of room 824 and the SCA office. Students from each grade level are eligible to be on court. However, students must first apply to be selected. Applications are due on Friday, September 15th at 2.05 p.m. It is also National Art Week. Kempsville is so incredibly lucky to have such creative art students walking our halls. This week, we would like to feature three of those artists, Carson Fitch, Myron Goodman, and Yasmeen Myrick. These artists' creativity is reflected in their modern pieces and inspires us to search for our muse and take an art class if we can. See Mr. Kruger, Ms. McManus, or Mr. Daughtery for more information if you're interested in pursuing the arts. We would also like to congratulate our very own Sean Spearman, who was selected as the first EVA Student Spotlight recipient of the year. Way to go, Shani. What's up, Chiefs? I'm Kylie. And I'm Ellie. Built into the DNA of our school are the various ways to get involved with the Kempsville community. From the general council meetings of the SEA to the lively energy of being on the field, there's something for you at Kempsville. We decided to get a first-hand account, an inside look at how Kempsville students are engaged with the community. We interviewed two individuals who are heavily involved at Kempsville to see what they had to say. We asked a series of three questions. What are you involved in at Kempsville? How do I get involved with Kempsville activity? And how has getting involved helped your high school experience? I'm very involved here at Kempsville. I'm a four-year varsity member of the football team. I've been on the varsity tennis team for this is going on my third year, my second year on the swim team. And I'm also the vice president of marketing for DECA. I'm a National Honor Society. I just like to make myself very involved within the school. Being so involved with the school has really opened my perspective of our Kempsville community and has improved my confidence with public speaking, facilitating big groups, um, and has also given me opportunities that will help me like get to the, you know, the colleges I want. Before you jump in, there's some things you should know first. Hi, I'm Ms. Conaway and I'm the Student Activities Coordinator here at Kempsville High School. Um, I think all students should get involved in at least one club um, or activity or sports team. Um, it's so important to get involved as a way to make um, new friends, make connections, learn more about yourself, um, hone in your leadership skills, uh, and further prepare you for whatever it is that you decide you want to do um, after high school. So definitely a big fan of getting involved. If you want some more resources, come see me in the Student Activities Office, and I'm happy to help you find what best matches your interests. We understand that this is just scratching the surface of what you can accomplish during your time as a chief. But not to fret, we have a solution. We are currently in the works of a long-term project whose sole purpose will be to give you, the student, an in-depth discovery into what Kempsville has to offer. Each episode of Chief Chats will dig deep into one sport, club, or organization here at Kempsville, giving a behind the scenes look at that involvement. We are incredibly excited to share with you what's in store and are ready to make this year at Kempsville, one for the history books. Stay tuned on our social media to check out more information. That's all for special announcements. Now on to Kylie with clubs and organizations. Thanks, Ian. Come to the first second meeting of the year on Monday, September 18th during lunch in room 305. They will teach you how to make money, make friends, and make a difference. We are also excited to announce that KHS is starting a mock trial club. Please join for an interest meeting during lunch on Monday, September 18th in room 805. If you can't attend the meeting but want to participate, please contact Mr. Rossantini for more information. Kempsville will also have their first Resilience Fund meeting of the school year. The purpose of the clubs is to make emergency preparedness kits and give them to people in areas of need. Currently, there are eight clubs nationwide and are sending bags to international internationally to places like Vietnam, Israel, Kenya, and South Africa. The first meeting is Friday, September 15th with Food and Fun in room 207. The Interact Club will have its first meeting next week after school on Tuesday, September 19th from 2 to 3 p.m. in room 601. Come learn how you can get more involved in the community through service. That's all for clubs and organizations. Now into sports. Thank you, Kylie. Today, the Kempsville golf team will have their rounds at BB National against Lansdowne. And in addition, field hockey, boys and girls volleyball, and varsity football will have away games of their own. Best of luck, Chiefs. That's all for the morning announcements. I'm Ian. And I'm Kylie. And have a great rest of your day. Cheers.